suggesting that we take one minute each to respond to what we have in here, and then we go into the discussions. Um, I, I feel very connected to, to what each of you said, and from Verna, 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 uh, the idea of equally, equal dignity, relationships of equal dignity, and the profoundly human um, nature of the need to be connected to our world. I totally feel you when you talk about creating a world that is better for our kids. And I usually talk about um, the importance of creating a public educational system where we would be proud to send our kids. And then when we get there, we're in a good place. And I think we're very far from it. <coughs> and uh, I talk to you, um, and when you talk about the structural constraints for a possibility of connection, not many of us are having the opportunity to connect to what we're most passionate about. Uh, I think the schools are, in, in a way, a microcosm. The, the relationships in the school are a modeling scale of the relationships between the state and citizens. And uh, I think that by transforming the relationships within our classrooms, with our people, with our, with our kids, we need to think about how to turn that kind of relationship, this relationship of caring, of people, dignity, uh, to the relationship between the state and ourselves as citizens. That involves struggling against the constraints that are limiting us from the possibility of connecting and treating each other with people living. Sometimes that requires struggle, sometimes that requires dialogue. In the case of our work in Mexico, we were able to take to occupy a position of power in the Ministry of Education. We made the commitment to shift the, the power model, the power dynamics, so that we can engage in equal dialogue relationships of people's dignity with teachers and working at the, at the grassroots level. Sometimes we don't get access to that, that position of power, but we need to engage with those in power as well. Otherwise, we will stay isolated. And I, I understand how, fear, how, how much fear you can feel when having to go beyond your comfort zone. Uh, it requires more struggle and it requires a lot of storage. So the invitation I want to make here